Best Exercises for a Bigger Chest 2023 In today's video, we're revealing the top 8 tips that will help grow your chest. Stay tuned because you don't want to miss this. Welcome back to Fit Lifestyle, the ultimate hub for fitness content. If you're looking to become fit and live a healthy lifestyle, then you're in the right place. But before we dive in, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications to never miss another fitness update. Without further ado, let's jump into our list of the top 8 tips to grow your chest. Number 8. Flat Dumbbell Bench Press How to do it? Start by sitting up on a flat bench holding a pair of dumbbells on your thighs. Lie back and bring the dumbbells into place, palms facing out, elbows bent at 90 degrees, hands and arms positioned slightly below and wider than your shoulders. If you're working with really heavy weights, kick your knees back so the weights have some momentum to get into the starting position and take some of the strain off of your joints. Push the dumbbells straight up with a forceful motion that resembles an arc. At the top of the movement, the dumbbells will hover over your chest. Pull your shoulder blades together on the way down, maintaining control as you repeat. Why it's effective Dumbbells allow you to address possible muscle imbalances between your right and left sides and also allow for a greater range of motion than a barbell. Number 7. Incline Dumbbell Bench Press How to do it Position the bench so it's at a 30 to 45 degree angle. Start by sitting up, holding a pair of dumbbells on your thighs. Using your knees, kick up one of the dumbbells at a time to shoulder level. In the starting position, your hands and arms should be positioned slightly below and wider than your shoulders. Push the dumbbells swiftly to create a motion that resembles an arc. At the top of the movement, let them hover over your chest. Pull your shoulder blades together on the way down. Why it's effective Just like the flat dumbbell bench press, the incline press allows you to address imbalances and weaknesses. Number 6. Cable Crossovers How to do it Place the pulleys of a cable machine to a high position, above your head. Select your resistance and hold the handles of the pulley in each hand using an overhand grip. Come into an athletic stance, so one leg is in front of the other, there's a soft bend in your knees, and you're leaning forward a bit. With your arms outstretched toward each pulley, curl and pull them together in an arc so your hands nearly touch. Slowly resist the tension until your arms are about to straighten, then repeat. Why it's effective One of the key functions of your chest muscles is to pull your arms toward your body, like you're hugging something. Cable crossovers hit your chest from a different angle and train it as it was designed to function. Number 5. Pec Deck How to do it Set up the pec deck so the vertical bars are positioned close to the machine. Adjust the seat so the handles are roughly chest height. While facing away from the machine, reach back with one hand to grab one handle, then the other. Pull the handles together and resist tension on the way back. Why it's effective Similar to the cable crossover, this machine trains a different movement pattern than most pushing chest exercises like bench press or push-ups. Number 4. Push-ups How to do it? Position your body so your wrists are aligned under your shoulders, arms straight, abs tight, and fingers spread wide to support your weight. Lower your body until your chest is an inch or two above the floor. Push away from the ground until your arms lock. Why they're effective Push-ups are a proven muscle builder because they directly target your pecs, among other muscles, and add more volume to your chest routine. Number 3. Racked Kettlebell Carries how to do it Clean two heavy kettlebells into a racked position across your chest. You can clasp your hands if you need. Keep your chest and back upright and walk 25 meters. Why it's effective Because you hold the weights close to your chest to prevent them from falling off the sides of your body, the strain on your chest muscles and abs is substantial. This exercise stimulates your chest muscles differently than a pressing movement. Number 2 Wide Grip Dips How to do it Keeping your arms straight, hold your body up on two parallel bars that are a couple of inches wider than shoulder width apart. Descend until your chest is roughly in line with your hands, then push back to the starting position, locking out your elbows. Why they're effective Dips allow you to create a large range of motion at the bottom of the exercise and a powerful contraction at the top. 
They can help you create that zipper effect in the middle of your chest, too. Number 1. Machine Press How to do it Select your desired weight and adjust the bench so the handles are roughly in line with the middle of your chest. Press the weights, keeping your head, neck, and back neutral. Keep your shoulders, back, and abs tight. Why they're effective Because the machine is fixed in place, your chest muscles, not the smaller stabilizer ones, are primarily involved in pushing the weight. And that wraps up our top 8 ways to grow your chest. We hope you found these 8 tips helpful. Which of these tips was your favorite? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next fitness adventure here on Fit Lifestyle.